guys, Anika. Welcome to my channel. So I'm really freaking sick today. I stayed home sick from school, but today I'm going to be doing a haul. I figured that I would take advantage of this sick day. Get shit done. I have a lot of shit to show you guys. Look at this. We got some Dolls Kill So Aesthetic, which actually, this video is sponsored by So Aesthetic. I want to thank them so much for sponsoring this video. They sent me a bunch of clothes. I really like the clothes that they sent me. I'm going to be showing them, of course, and this is a try-on haul. I have another try-on haul where I'm going to be testing out Zaffle swimsuit which I feel like is gonna be really interesting. I'm kind of nervous because I have tried them out before but it wasn't really a great experience. But today I'm going to show you what I got from these places. First we'll start off with So Aesthetic. I'm so excited that they sent me clothes. It makes me so happy. They sent me two pairs of glasses. I got these pink ones. The bridge. I don't even know what you call this. It's a little bit too far apart. I wish. I'm trying to think if there's anything I can do. I don't think there's anything I can do to make them closer together. My eyes are just not that far apart. They look kind of weird but in some angles you can make it work so they're good for pictures I'm so freaking sick boy then I also got these heart glasses which I love these they're yellow I think they're so cute I feel like yellow isn't the most flattering color for sunglasses I wish I had gotten like blue or red or something <laughs> I'm a boy boy too, she really. So those are two glasses I got. Next, I got this hoodie. I love this hoodie, actually. It says girls, girls, girls on the front and then on the back. <laughs> it says girls, girls, girls. I think it may be like girl empowerment, but it also may be like gay. Because I feel like, aren't there like strip clubs and like the signs say like girls, girls, girls. I feel like that's what I think of when I look at this. I like it. The pink is kind of like a little bit holographic. It's really oversized and really comfy. The only thing is, it doesn't come with the little tassel, like not tassels, but the little, comes with the little holes for the hoodie, but not the drawstring. Next, they sent me this shirt that says written and directed by Quentin Tarantino. I saw this on Almighty, so I thought it was really cool that they had like a kind of dupe for it. It's really cute. It has like black stripes on the sleeve. It's really freaking dope. Yeah, honestly, I don't know who Quentin Tarantino is. Ew. Ew, he's like an old white guy. Ew, I don't wanna... <laughs> I think the shirt is wicked cute. I'll probably wear it in a few pictures, but there are quotes from him, and one of his quotes says, violence is one of the most fun things to watch. And then I also got these joggers, which are super cool. I will say that the quality isn't the best, but they are very warm, I would say. It's not that the quality isn't the best, it's just the feeling of the fabric is a little bit different. There's like a zipper, but only halfway down from the mid-thigh down. It's weird, but it's cool. And then it cuffs back again at the ankle. I don't know, I think it's cool. They're like orange, and they have the checkered on the side. Kind of like a hoe for that checkered shit. I don't really know why. Another checkered thing. I got this tube top, which I think is wicked cute. The only person who texts me is my dad. Also, I'm not wearing makeup, so I'm sorry if I look really, really gross. I apologize deeply. That was a tube top. It almost feels like a bathing suit, but it's really comfortable and it actually stays up really well. I noted that. Like, I don't have to wear a bra with it and I don't have to pull it up a lot. Like, I don't know. I feel like it's completely not see-through, so I don't have to wear a bra. And if it is, you can just hope that your nipple lands underneath one of the black checkers. Shoves everything back into the box. Next, I'm going to show you some random things that I got when I went shopping at the mall. I got this Brandy Melville sweatshirt. It's really, really cute, really comfy. I don't remember how much it was, but it was definitely way too expensive. Los Angeles. Los Angeles, 1984. What happened in 1984? When you Google Los Angeles, 1984, it's just the Olympics, so. Then I went to H&M, and I, okay, I was kind of unsure about this, and I just kind of bought it on a whim, but I feel like it's going to be really cool, because I feel like Cheetah is coming back in for some reason. I'm not quite sure why. So I got this romper. I feel like this would be really cute, even in, like, fall, when it's getting a little bit colder out, but it's still, like, warm enough to wear short. I could do this, and then, like, a fur coat. I feel like that would be wicked cute. Oh, fur coat, of course. <laughs> it's really really flattering actually because it has a cinched waist and it has fucking pockets it was $17.99 it's in a size 2 and it's actually like not too hoey like it covers my under butt which is really like oh my god then from PacSun I got these jeans shorts jeans shorts I was kind of unsure about them at first but I just love the back and I've never seen anything I, I probably have and even more rare than like these cool multi wash shorts is that they were in a size 23 and I was like 
bitch. I've never seen a size smaller than 24 in store ever. I'm sure they sell them, but I've just never seen them. And that's my freaking pant size. Oh my god. These were $44.95, but I had an $11 gift card because I think I returned something a while ago. So they were like... my last two brain cells trying to solve a math equation. I can't do it. From Zoomies, I know this is really random, but I was shopping with my brother and his friends and they went into Zoomies. I just got these flip flops because I'm going to Texas and I don't have any flip flops that are cute. They were $17.95. Way too expensive for flip flops, but they feel really sturdy. They have these really cute. Okay, foot fetish time. Are we gonna do this? We're gonna do this. I didn't even try them on. I just kind of went with it. I hashtag know myself. From Forever 21. I actually got this a while ago. This is kind of a collective haul. Um, I literally have never worn this jumpsuit halter. It was $23. It's actually really cute. I hate myself so fucking much. Why can I not describe anything for the life of me? My school is really annoying. We don't have semi. We don't have coattail. We don't have prom. Even for the juniors and seniors, we don't have prom. We have fucking boat dance. Where we all pitch in $75 and we rent a fucking yacht. We go on the yacht for like three hours. And I don't know. I haven't been yet. It's on Saturday. I'm not quite sure how I feel about it. It, but this is a dress that I got for it. Everybody says that there's one freshman that always like overdoes it and thinks that it's like prom and so like there's a really bougie dress and so I made sure that I was not that freshman because everybody already hates me. <laughs> it's so cute. It's from free people. I spent way too much money on it but it's okay because at the time I could afford it. It's fine. It was like $75. It fits really well. It really is a gorgeous like bohemian dress. This is literally my aesthetic in one dress and I'm happy that I have it even though it is a little bit see-through. Then from Express, another random store, but again, I was shopping with my brother and his friends. I got this cute little belt thing. It's really cute. I need to figure out how to untie this knot because it's really loose and I need to tie it. It's really cute. I think it would look good with like a white t-shirt and jeans. I don't really know. And then everything else is shit that I ordered online slash Dolls Kill sent me a few things. From Urban, I got this fanny pack. Everybody says it's ugly, but I love it. It's Adidas. It's baby yellow. The thing is, like, it's ugly, but you just have to embrace the fact that it's just like ugly and it's a meme. You can either wear it across your body, which I sometimes fuck with. I have to loosen the straps and right now it's safety pins so that it'll fit around my waist. Um, or you can wear it around your waist. It was $30. I don't want to talk about it. And then I got two dresses because a few days ago, it was like a while ago. This, this is a really collective haul. It just took them forever to come. Like, what the hell? I don't know why. They had like a dresses and rompers were 20% off. So I got two dresses. I got this peach one with like really cool metal clasp. Like, not clasp. Like, the adjusters are metal and then this thing is metal. It has little flowers all around it. I usually don't wear a bra with it just because the sides go so low. And then I also... <laughs> and then I also got this dress, which I love. I got so many compliments on. It's this like really like beautiful royal blue color with red flowers all over it. It's like off the shoulder and it has buttons. It's mad annoying to wear because it's off the shoulder. But do it for the cute at my rate. I got a few things from Pretty Little Thing. I got a belt, which I returned. I got these pants, which I can't find. It was really weird because one of the leg holes was much smaller than the other one. And so I literally like my leg got stuck in it and I had to cut my leg out of it. It was wild. But then I got these black shorts, which actually actually are really cute and they fit really well. They're like expensive. They're like priced like American Eagle, I guess. And like, I feel like they're not that great quality. And then a few months ago, my brother got me a hoodie from the Antisocial Social Club drop. He never got me a Christmas present. He didn't get me a birthday present either. So I made him get this for me, even though it was mad expensive. It's really cute. It's like this camo and then it has ink. Antisocial Social Club. Antisocial Social Club. It's really comfortable. It actually looks really good with the Adidas fanny pack and just like some black jeans. Very cash. Okay. And then everything else I got is from Dolls Kill and so excited. They also sent these clothes over, but it's not a sponsored video. They just sent these to me. First, I got this Buns Are Low Need a Sugar Daddy little coin purse. I think this is so fucking cute and so funny. It's like a wristlet. I got these two boots from the brand Poster Girl. Well, yeah, obviously I got two boots. I got these boots from Poster Girl. They're so cute. They're black and they have like a neon orange interior and they're just kind of like combat boots. I don't know. What you want me to say, sister? <coughs> 
this dress, which is super dope. It's really short, though. But I feel like if I had gone a size up, it wouldn't have fit my actual body. I think it's an extra small. Yeah, it's an extra small. Basically, it just has, like, a bunch of tabloids all around it. It's a dress, and then it has, like, a little, these little O-rings that separate, like, the top from the bottom of the dress. It's really cool. My dad even likes it, which is weird, because I look like a baby prostitute in it. And I got this skirt, which I think Tana Mongoose has. I'm gay for her. It has this little slipper on the side. It's neon orange and black. Not neon orange. Am I fucking blind? Neon yellow. This is in a size extra small. I feel like they have really good sizing. They almost always have an extra small. I don't know about extra large because I wasn't looking for that. But then I got this shirt, which I really can't figure out. But yeah, it's like a bandana, but like, I think like this. The chain goes like too low unless I literally don't want it to be on my boobs. So I think I need to find some way to adjust it. But like for now, I'm thinking that I'll just like drape it over my shoulders and just hope it doesn't fly the fuck off. The next thing is probably my favorite thing that I got. It's this like dope ass crochet corset and it literally has like the bra buckles in the back like this is a full on corset and then it has these crocheted arms that flare out at the end and it like hooks around your shoulder so it does fall off if you kind of hunch but it just encourages you to keep your posture nice and fresh. Love this. It's so cute. It fits me so well. I'm so happy about it. It's in a size small. And then the last thing that is in this haul I'm pretty sure are these pants. They're really cool. They're like I don't even know what you call these. They're just like these cargo pants almost I guess. They have pockets on them so yeah I guess. And then they have suspenders which I guess theoretically you could wear up but the model is wearing them down and I think I'm gonna wear them down as well. There's like a dark blue and then they have white stripes. I think they're really cool. I think it's cool how it's like a masculine pant that it's like being feminized I guess. Um so yeah that's everything in my haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed. I'm sorry that I'm so sick and so down but I, I'm trying to put out content for you guys even though I'm sick because I know you guys have been missing me and I miss you guys too. I enjoy filming. It's just like oh it's such a drag that I've been in such like a bad mood these past few weeks but I'm so excited for summer because I'm gonna get my shit worked the fuck out and we're gonna be over this. We're gonna be fucking over this. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment, rate, subscribe, suck my dick and keep on hauling.